stem cells, your body's natural healing system. You get a cut on your finger, the next day it heals up. How does that happen? By age 65, you've lost 90% of your output of adult stem cells. But now you may be able to boost stem cell levels naturally within one hour by 30% with a new plant-based capsule. Everyone's chemistry is different, but for many, this produces a variety of benefits to reduce the effects of aging. Beth and I take this every day. It's even worked on Beth's 90-year-old mom. After just two months of Stem Enhance Ultra, her blood pressure dropped from 147 over 82 to 103 over 61. Check out our website at billstill.cerule.com. Good afternoon. I'm still reporting on the potential end of the coup. According to yesterday's Washington Post, President Trump's poll numbers are still soaring into new heights among non-white voters. Their opening graph tells it all by its tone. Either former President Donald Trump's standing in early 2024 polls is inflated, or we are headed for a sizable realignment in how non-white voters cast their ballots. Across five high-quality polls that have broken out non-white voters in the past month, Trump is averaging 20% of black voters and 42% of Hispanic voters. Both numbers, and especially that for black voters, could set modern-day records for a Republican in a presidential election. Well, duh, yep, people are finally getting it. The Desperado Party is flooding the country with cheap labor, and guess what group is hit hardest? Hispanics are traditionally Christians, Catholics, and know better than most that wokeness is purely a disguised form of madness, being involuntarily imposed on the land of the free and the home of the brave to sow confusion. Traditional polling wisdom has been that if Trump polls at 15%, the Desperado Party is toast. But these new polling numbers for Hispanics are more than twice that high. Hispanic voters have been trending Republican for several recent elections, but over the past 50 years, the GOP has never gotten more than 37% of them. With Hispanic numbers now approaching 50%, it looks like curtains for the desperados, not counting illegal use of drop boxes, no voter ID voting, continued outright voting machine numbers manipulation, and stop the count raw illegal numbers dumps at 3 a.m. Yeah, practically no one over the past three years has been prosecuted for any of this. So what's the deterrent preventing it from happening again and again? There is none. Still, it's just another piece of good news and we are still 14 months out. The thing I really don't believe is that Trump is neck and neck with the big man. Biden couldn't draw a crowd if he announced that the first hundred folks in the door would get a hundred dollar bill. Every single one of Trump's events are still bringing in unprecedented swarms of MAGAs chanting USA, USA, USA in numbers measured in the tens of thousands per event. There's never been anything like Trump's ability to draw crowds in American history. I'm still reporting from just outside the citadel of world freedom. Good day.